good with YouTube. It is your boy Vaughn, and as you guys can see by the title, baby, we are back with a new reaction video for you guys today. And we actually have the first Darman video we are reacting to of the year. We're going to be dropping plenty and plenty of Darman reaction videos. So if you guys enjoy this, please like this video and make sure you guys show major support. But today we have Homeless Man is Richer Than a Millionaire. Hmm, hmm. We ain't finna do too much talking, baby. Original video will always be in the description down below, and my new channel for the gaming content is in the description down below as well. If you guys could follow those, I would greatly appreciate it. And make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on. That way you do not miss any of the uploads. And without further ado, baby, we finna dive right into this. Let's get it, man. Homeless like man is richer than a millionaire. For one million dollars. <laughs> you know the black dollar, folk gonna look for so like oh no what? I would have a million dollars. <laughs> Who said I was kidding? First of all, first of all, ma'am, you just need to be doing oh, your wow. job, you not counting pockets. Mm -hmm. She pocket watching pretty much right no now. No idea. We don't. We don't. We don't like that. To say that I haven't taken a day off in thirty-five years, not one single day. In fact, the last Damn. time I remember working less than fourteen hours a day actually was when my wife was in labor. And even that day, I put in a solid 12 hours. <laughs> Bro, you know what's crazy? Okay. Actually hearing this right now, guys, like th what, he, what he was just saying, like that kind of stuff really happens. I actually know somebody, bro, who was dating somebody like I, I know somebody who was dating somebody, but they these were like old people. Like I'm talking like 60s. OK. And the guy became a millionaire off of working nine to five jobs and saving up his money for several years and he became a millionaire and bought properties. Like I personally know these people, bro, in my life. Like that shit is crazy. That shit really can happen. A that lot of people don't have scary. that kind of mindset though when it comes to that. I don't know if it's a lot impressive. of people are mentally strong enough to get through something Whenever like you're that. Ready. That's a, oh, yes, uh, 35 absolutely. years, bro, <laughs> is insane. 14 hours a day is crazy. Let me get that for you. Here you go. Thank you. You know that boy didn't want to hand up that check. Uh, <laughs> he didn't want to get that me. check up. <laughs> I, I don't mean to be nosy, but do you mind if I ask you what you do for a living? Not at all. I'm Tony Rodriguez from Rodriguez and Associates. I'm a consultant, and I built my business from ground up. Wow, that's amazing. You know, I never would have thought that you'd be a millionaire judging by your clothes, but I guess it's true what they say. The poor is flashy, the rich is loud and wealthy. It's quiet. Mm, don't get me wrong. I'm about to get as flashy as it can be. This is the first thing I'm going to buy. A Rolls Royce. And you can do that when you save all of your money all the time. You see this iPhone? He's here? frugal as I've fuck, bro. Like, like, I wish I was like when this. I said like, myself, I, I want to be this frugal. Anything, I'm not going to lie to you. Unless his bare necessities until my account hits the seven figure mark. You know what's crazy? I'm actually a motivational speaker, and you're motivating me so much right now. And I can see that you work out, man. Hey, I don't miss a day at the gym. Oh, don't have cake, dessert. Haven't One thing I can say, though, here. this, though, about, Even like, what I wise. feel like, like, I'm still in the younger stage of my life. But like I'm getting older, okay. So one thing I think about with what they were just, like with this guy's story, working for 35 years and just sticking to the same schedule. I feel like as you get, I've never really had like a schedule in my life, okay. Like maybe in high school and going through college, but as my adulthood doing YouTube and stuff that I've done over the last six years of my life, I've never had a schedule, bro. Like I might have a schedule when I post my videos, but I've never had like an actual schedule in my daily life and i feel like as i get older to remember things better like i mean my like i'm good when it comes to that but like i'm just saying like i feel like having a schedule is important as an older person if that makes sense birthday i haven't had a slice of cake yo that's discipline sheesh yeah I wish crazy I like discipline you, but between my wife kids and me coaching my online community five times a week i barely have time to work out or even eat healthy five times a week why not seven times a week? That way you'll get faster to your seven-figure mark. Uh, I, nah, I, I won't work. Like, my wife would kill me. Well, I don't think your wife is going to be very mad when she's riding on your Rolls Royce. <laughs> hey, All right. You got well, a good point. Congratulations, <laughs> Mr. Rodriguez. You're officially a millionaire. Well, at least in three days when your check clears. Of course. Thank you so much. 
Wow. Hey, Tony, uh, you mind if I reach out to you sometimes? You know, kind of like a mentor? Of course. Absolutely. All you got to do is remember one thing. Never allow anyone to distract you. And always keep your eyes on the prize. As always. Yes. Thanks, Tony. You're welcome. Hey, good morning. All right, good session today. <laughs> I wanted to see how much he was going to deposit, bro. <laughs> they, they cut that out, though. Hey guys, but before I, I like to deposit $150. Okay, for those who are very interested and motivated to take their game to the next level in 2024. All right, now all you guys are already enrolled in Hustle Hard. Now, this one is called Hustle Harder. Okay. okay, it's a live seven days a week session with me. It's an extra $19.99 a month. If you're interested, go ahead and drop with a hundred emoji in the live chat. Let's go ahead. Dad! Oh. Oh, up. Daddy, it's not time to work now. It's time to play now. We're gonna watch a new troll. Mm, this is one thing that scares me session. when it comes to having kids right, to be so in the content creator. Okay? Come on, guys. I don't want to have to deal with this, my boy. But I would also. Said Love to deal with it at the same time. Ago. We were waiting in the living room for you to watch the movie. Yeah, well, the next time we're going to watch a movie, I'm going to make sure it's done on a crappy 40 inch plasma. It's going to be in a brand new home theater, 100 inch projector, platinum. You he said platinum. That's why I got <laughs> Throw go some a respect bit on him. Platinum. Oh, I still got more work to do, but I'll be out there in a little bit, okay? Gosh. You're still taking me to go see the new Aquaman movie like you promised, right? Of course, CJ. Now you guys go. Daddy still got some more work to do. Go, go, go. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Happy wife, happy life. Am I right? But you guys did see how my family. His viewership didn't drop at all. Just chill and relax. I call that a distraction. Okay. The key to success is staying focused, keeping your eyes on that prize. And that's exactly why I got that seven day program for those who are really, really motivated to go ahead and crush like I am. Okay. Let's get it. I'm telling you, Tony, I'm the prize, baby. Feel like God sent Tony right on time. I feel more motivated than ever. Now, I overheard you saying you're going to be streaming seven days a week now. <sighs> yeah. Actually. I, I, I support the grind. I support the grind. See, I support that. He made me realize that I need to stay focused, work hard now, so that later I can enjoy the finer things in life. And when would that be? When we're too old to enjoy them, or after life has passed us by? You know, I don't care about the finer things. I do care about our family. You know, the kids are growing up really fast, Chris. You don't think I know that? That's why I'm trying to secure a successful future for them too. If you want them to be successful, maybe their motivational father could be around more often. You know, time spent with them is more important than money spent. Look, babe. It's not like I'm not here. I'm just working, that's all. Like, I, you know, it's, bro, oh my gosh. I've experienced this kind of stuff, bro. Like, I love this episode. Like, I feel him. I feel him, bro. Like, uh, oh, there's so much I could probably say. Now, come on, can we talk about something else? Like, let a man work. Let a man do what he, you know, let a man grind and support his family. Oh, y'all still know, in the same, y'all still in the same house. Y'all still in the same home. Ben and Jerry's cookie like, dough. Like, you should, you should. <laughs> That should, with me? that should be a blessing Please. to have those kind of, you know, capabilities. Oh, you know what I mean? I only have some and you have some. Oh. Like, it's the best of both worlds. Your man at home and he working at home. Chris. Huh? In the same in the same spot. No, no, no. Same I, space. I can't have no ice cream. I keep my eyes on the prize. Let's get it. I was gonna run two miles, but I ended up running a 5K, and I feel amazing. You know, uh, Tony recommended this new protein shake. I must say, I'm impressed. Does it taste good? Or? I don't drink it for the taste, babe. I drink it for the macros. You know, there's 25 grams of protein per scoop. 
And four scoops of protein is like eating two whole chicken breasts. Do you need that much protein? Never mind. <laughs> I would have been like, hey, do you need some protein, baby? Let me start eating these cookies. <laughs> Let, Let me chill. Me the Let me chill, y'all. Uh, <laughs> Tony just invited me to go to the car dealership. You know he's about to buy a brand new Rolls Royce? That's amazing, right? Crazy. Just don't take too long. You know, Aquaman starts at one, and CJ is really excited about seeing it. And you also promised Ari that you were going to build gingerbread houses with her. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. now that's important. Like, yeah. I ain't going to lie. Regardless of what invite I had in that situation, I'm going to make sure my kids are attended to Even first, though, for sure. You know, I should be working. It's Christmas Eve. You can take a couple of days off for the holidays. Yeah, well, not if I'm trying to become a millionaire in the next 10, 15 years. Well, look, gotta go. Love you. Bye. Bye. Oh, could you remember to grab those ingredients for the gingerbread houses? They close early tonight. I promise I won't forget. I wonder what he's thinking. That guy could well, be a jail, a person that was in jail doing community day. service too. You never know. Christmas indeed. <laughs> he need to he need to change his haircut, bro. So well, so <laughs> Them hick sideburns is not hey, doing it. They not hey, doing Chris. it. That boy Tony, Tony Montana. Wow, let's take a look at this baby. <laughs> of course, he got the jet black. Of course. Well, Chris, one day a baby like this can be yours with a little sacrifice. A lot of sacrifice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it'll be worth it, trust me. Yeah, I, I can see that. Oh, man. Well, I wish my wife could, too. You know, she's been on my case, man. Like, like even at <laughs> on my case. Things, she didn't go for that. And I tried getting out of going to the movies with her and the kids, and it was a no-go. She said no. You know what? Don't worry about it. My wife used to neck me all the time. You don't need to spend enough time with me. You don't spend enough time with your son. You're working way too much. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Yo, are you sure that our wives aren't related? Oh, my God, are you kidding me, you know? She might be mad now. Yeah. But later, when your friends at the country club see you pulling up in this baby, Trust me, she'll forget all about all the. I mean, I mean, I will say this though: like materialistic things aren't everything. Also, at the end of the day, so it will be nice to have those things. But if, like, that also shouldn't only make your wife and the mother of your kids happy. You feel me? Like, if that makes sense. Movies, all the dates you missed, all the nights you were in there, all of that. Like all this ain't gonna make. All that wouldn't make up for that. I can agree with that. The year, so do you want to spend it watching movies or getting ahead on all of your twenty-four goals? Huh? I say put your phone on silent and focus. That's what you Nah, need don't to do. don't put you know, the wifey on you silent. Keep That's your crazy. Eyes on the prize. You know what I mean. Man, don't do that. You have no idea how much I'm motivated right now. You're absolutely right. I mean, what is she gonna do? Divorce me? And no one's gonna be divorcing a millionaire. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take your advice, man. Hey, <laughs> they definitely looking at this in the wrong way now. This way from motivational to no, disappointing. Side, side, the same ballet, the same place, just yes. both of our Rolls Royce. You watch, it's gonna happen. But I, 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 I get how you feel though, if you're a person that likes to grind uh, though. I get that I, I because you, I'm, I'm like that as like well. And sometimes and I feel like there's not I'd enough time in a day to do rolls, everything that you want to do and everything that's on your mind. Like there's definitely not enough time in a day. See you, Tony. Thank you. Hey, my man, uh, got a few. Oh, uh, no, I'm good for the day. I got to spend some time with my son. I'm going to take him out for some ice cream, you know? You think that's enough? <laughs> Come on, look, the more cans you get, the more money you make, right? You know, if I were you, I would go across town collecting thousands of cans. You know, why not grind a little bit harder to get more money, right? And what will that do for me? Kidding me, right? Look. I just saw a guy spin. Complacent. Complacent. On That's important. Complacent. You think he got that by leaving work early? No. 
if you collect more cans, then you can hire eventually more people to go ahead and collect thousands of cans for you. You know, build a little army, 10, 15, 20 can collectors. You know, all making money for you. Man, what do I do? This guy. Okay. Um, once you do that, you can buy <laughs> that was kind of disrespectful. Trucks, he said, this guy. This guy. This guy. Maybe you can buy your own and create your own recycling processing plant to make thousands and millions of cans. You know, the, it's, it's, it's unlimited. You get it, right? So I do all of that. Yeah. And what do I do? I can't believe I'm happy to explain all this. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh my God, bro. The way that he's reacting to this reminds me of one of my friend's dads, bro. One of my best friends, their dad acts just like this, bro. <laughs> he says shit like, he says crazy shit like that whenever. <laughs> I'll talk about my friend Damien, by the way. His dad, bro. Oh my god, Damien's dad acts just like this nigga right now. <laughs> I'm really Once weak right now. You're processing thousands and thousands of cans, making millions of dollars. Then you can go ahead and do anything you want. Anything. Leave work early, spend some time with your son, get some ice cream, whatever you want. Isn't that what I'm doing already? <laughs> See this? This is my wife texting me, telling me to put my goals on a back burner. And do you know what I'm about to do? Put her on silent. Oh, right? he going crazy. I'm staying focused. He's staying on. He's standing on business and, and going crazy. Like, think about it. Thank you so much. What y'all got for me? Where's dad? You know what? Um, I'm sure he'll be here soon, honey. Yeah. He's like, okay. And <laughs> now her shrugging her shoulders and texting. Okay. okay. Number one, come millionaire. Yeah, no, like he, like this is getting corny now. He, like he, he really doing too much because just because you're staying focused Rose. on everything doesn't mean it's gonna like, it's, bro. This just it, it's not making sense. They're going, he's going about this the wrong way. Three, bye. A mansion. <laughs> he got his eyes on too many prizes. What else? Would I At this point, he daydreaming. Oh. He not even working. Oh, He's not even working right now. He's just dangerous. Are you okay, sweetheart? Dad promised he would be here, but he's not even here. I'm sure something really important came up while he'd be here. She holding it down. Mama Duke's holding it down. After this. Absolutely. Your dad already went out and got everything. So forget the saying that good things come to those that are patient. You know what I say? I say good things come to those that work the bus off for it. You know what I'm saying? Now look at you guys, all in my work harder program, working your butts off, working your tails off on. You went from 52 to 20. Christmas Eve with me, and we gonna do the same thing tomorrow. And I do not care that it's the holidays. You feel me? So I'll see you guys tomorrow. And remember, keep your eyes on the prize. <laughs> oh, hey, babe. Hey, babe. I've been calling and texting you for hours, Chris. Oh, shoot. I'm so sorry, babe. I put my phone on silent. You promised you'd be there. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, little man. I was so in the zone and I got caught up with work. CJ, where are you going? Daddy, can we make the gingerbread houses now? Uh, okay, honey. How about you start with your mom and I'll be there to finish. I just got some work to do, okay? More work? It's Christmas Eve. You've been working all day. Where are the gingerbread houses? 
Oh, shit. Question to the ladies. Would you guys rather have a man that works hard like that and spends less time or have a man that is there but also talking to bitches on the side? <laughs> uh, I forgot to get I'll go to I'm childish. What would y'all rather have, bro? already, Chris. I told you. Because he ain't talking to no today. girls and he literally focused on just grinding. So we're not going to make the gingerbread house then? You broke your promise to me. All right, but... We make gingerbread houses on Christmas Eve every year. It's a tradition, Chris. Okay. What do you want me to say? I'm working. I got some goals to achieve, and I cannot worry about the little things that don't matter. Your kids don't matter? Your wife doesn't matter? Really, Chris? Don't put words in my mouth, Toddy. That's not what I said. You didn't have to say it. You've been showing it all week by putting work before everything. Ever since you met this Tony guy, it's like you're a, a whole different person. Well, this Tony guy is a millionaire. If that's what it takes to be like him, then that's what I'm going to do. You know, I'd rather date a broke Chris than this rich one. He doesn't even have time for his own family. Damn, is that true? Women are rather date a broke motherfucker? Yeah, well, she's gonna be thinking me real soon, just like Tony White's probably doing. Tony, my guy, I was just thinking about you. Hey, I'll hey, yo! Oh my god. And for those of you that knew my Tony. He was such Damn. a hard worker. He never took a single day off. That can't put a he toll on you. Every birthday, every holiday. Damn. Now he's seeing the other side. He's seeing grass isn't always greener on the other side. You feel me? And even every Christmas. Damn, this is a good ass episode of Dark Man. Bro. Say that he would want to work hard today so that we could all have a better tomorrow. But where is that better tomorrow now? The same car that he sacrificed his life trying to get is the same car that killed him in an accident. I'm sorry. Tony, do you see what you want about your dad? I don't really have much to say. I didn't know my dad that well. To be honest, he was never around. Damn. In the beginning, he broke a lot of promises to me. <laughs> he and just then, he just imagine sitting back there and eating all of this, bro. Like he just getting punched with everything right now. He bitch. just stopped <laughs> making them all completely. He probably would have never come out of his office if he wasn't to eat. Whenever I would see him, he would always say the same thing. Just keep your eyes on the prize, son. thinking about it now. I don't even think he knew what the real prize was. They got like a playpen in there and everything. Look at that one right there. Oh. Huh? What does that look like? That looks like a bald guy. It does look like a bald guy. And to the right. What is that? No, what? Like gotta enjoy. You gotta so enjoy that you. time you got with everybody. The man. And for sure, for sure. Oh man. There, I'll tell you what you, you want to get. Can't get time back, baby. They got all the crazy kid stuff. We'll go there. Yeah, let's go in a little bit. Man, they didn't even notice each other. He didn't even notice them. <laughs> Mom, can you help me, please? No 
what, sweetie? I've never been all that good with Legos. Why don't you ask your dad when he gets home? He never has time for me anymore. He still has to watch trolls with me. How was the funeral? Um, I guess you can say it made me realize a lot of things. What's going on, guys? No hug for your daddy. All right, so who can guess what we're going to do today? CJ? I don't know. You're working? Nope. Your daddy's not working today. So you don't have to work on your seven-day program? Not anymore. I got rid of it. And I actually changed the five-day program to four and a half days because every Friday afternoon is ice cream day. Really? Uh-huh. And I've got something in here for you, Missy. Are you going to make it with me? Of course I am. But not before we watch the new Trolls movie. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, and uh, <clears throat> I got something else in here for you, too, little man. Aquaman movie ticket? Well, we already saw that. Oh, I know you did. And guess what? We gonna watch it again. Uh -huh. And after that, we're gonna go to your favorite restaurant, Chick-fil-A. Pasta! <laughs> we love you, Daddy! <laughs> OK, I, you, I, I like this. Right, I love out. this. <laughs> uh, I got something in here for you, too, Miss Lady. Oh, and before you ask, yes, I'm going to have some with you, too. <laughs> you know, I'm starting to really like this new 2024, Chris. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> me. Uh, you sure you're going to be OK watching it on our crappy 40-inch plasma? Hey, you know what? I don't really care. As long as I'm with my family, I don't even care if it's on a 10-inch black and white TV screen. I'm happy now. Got my eyes on the real prize. Oh, you know who that. Well, oh. I ain't gonna lie. When I have kids, the kind of dad I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be playing with my toy. They go. I said my toys. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna be playing with their toys and shit with them, okay? Like, I, I didn't give up my Legos and Transformers and stuff until I was about 14, going on 15, but I still kept them in my room on, on the walls and shit like that. And uh, yeah, my kids are gonna have a good time. Darman life lessons are always absolute bangers. I really enjoyed this episode. This is a good way to start off 2024, man. Happy New Year's once again to everybody. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to my new channel. Link will be in the description down below. Original video will be down there as well. And I will see you guys in the next one, baby. We are out. Peace.